In the cloud, your information can be hijacked and exploited. The need for a tangible product that the masses can defend themselves with is a product of high importance. I've increasingly felt like there is no way to defend ourselves against technological totalitarianism. The cloud is a huge data center in which all of our private information, files, and data are centralized. Therefore, it is not an idealistic place where we would want to store our data in, at least in the way corporations would want us to believe in. Our product is not an NAS. It's not a home self-hosting server. It's not even a Tor router. It's much more than that. It's a grid. Major part of competitors are self-hosting solutions, but without a grid, there's no resilience. And we all know what the problem is when your data is all in one place. Users create the necessary infrastructure to serve the world with these cloud alternatives. In mass, creating the term resilience. Through Community Cube, the information is encrypted before leaving your computer. Then it's encrypted again and distributed in smaller parts. The parts are then spread geographically, impossible to read by anyone else except for the legitimate owner with the passwords. Your digital privacy and your location are protected. There is no way to track you or leak your data using Community Cube tools. Privacy configuration is important while internet surfing. Filters viruses, exploits, and potential malicious internet traffic transparently with no need of add-on or additionally installed software. You can transparently browse deep web like Tor and I2P without any modification of your computer, and you are protected against deep web government exploits, hidden services, or middlemen at any Tor node exits. Let's talk about Community Cube Alternative Fair Services Collaboration Storage System. First, let's log into your storage service and then upload a file to share with a friend. Whether you share a file with a friend or with unknown people, you are automatically anonymous and protected. With only one click, the download links directly from your home Community Cube, but is accessed anonymously. Or enable online collaborative editing with other people. And you can share your files, agendas, and other information with other friends. We call it federation. Or you can automatically back up your mobile photos in your Community Cube. Files that you save to your Community Cube are backed up in anonymous and secure grid storage. What is this grid or decentralization federated service? Each box contributes to create the biggest and the most secure services by sharing part of the hard drive and communicating anonymously over federated databases. We are secure social networkers, but there are many different networks. Our social network connects you and your social networks into a single combined network. You can publish simultaneously to all your social networks. You can communicate with your networks efficiently receiving all your friends' comments from other social networks. You don't have to open a ton of tabs for different social networks to know what your friends are doing. It's the clever way to be in contact and not to waste your time. What about searching stuff? To protect you, we have built an integrated search engine allowing you to find what you need on the internet. The biggest difference is that you are the administrator in our search engine, giving you full power. You can blacklist sites and content, or give greater relevance to your favorite sites. Community Cube search engine runs in tandem with all nodes, creating a network of search engine nodes working together. And the best part is that nobody tracks or associates you to your search, as can happen with others. When you're not at home and want to talk, there's no need to have a third party listening. You can easily get in touch with your friends or family. Your communications are secure and protected from eavesdroppers. Private meetings are as they should be, one person talking to another person. A computer connected directly with another, without a middleman. Easy, simple and secure, as email always should be. We communicate by email, but it's the least secure protocol that we use today. To solve this, we have integrated a secure way to communicate by email. Every single email is encrypted by default when it detects the destination email address has encryption available. You just write an email. It protects you with a 4096-bit encryption. It's so secure that you can continue using your regular email provider completely securely, even Gmail. And it's compatible with any device too.
we need to balance the internet's powers. So please, donate and share!